हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई डॉक्टर उमेश गारू असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर बी गर्ल्स कॉलेज आई वेलकम टू ऑल ऑन द बी हाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी ओ डॉट कॉम आई एम हेयर टू डिलीवर अ लेक्चर ऑन द टॉपिक ऑन द इम्यूनोलॉजी इज फ्रंट ऑफ यू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वॉन्ट टू इंट्रोड्यूस टू द बाई द स्टार्टिंग ऑफ द डेफिनेशन ऑफ इम्यूनोलॉजी वेन अ फॉरिन पार्टिकल एनी पैथोजन विच कॉन्टैक्ट विद द हॉस्ट इन एनी वे लाइक अ इंटेक योर फूड इन एनी वे ऑफ इट्स कॉन्टैक्ट विद द होस्ट बॉडी एंड This is the flow chart. When a foreign particle come into the hosted host body, what is happen in the host body? When foreign particle come <coughs> into the host body, mix in the blood, then then they play their biological activity and release some toxin. This toxin is if it affected to the host body in the very way of the um, on a large huge scale. <coughs> then the b cell which is in the blood of like a b lymphocyte which activated and multiplication as a plasma cell this plasma cell is change into the memory cell and make a antibody this antibody with the help of the t cells go to the target organ and bind to the foreign particle that it means the simple definition is the that when a foreign particle come into the host body and play their biological activity that time they release some toxin this same toxin is negatively affect to the host body that time it is called as the antigen when our body protect against to this antigen or foreign particle that is called our immune system this immune system divided on two types that the innate and the acquired when the the antibody ya yeah, immune system when we inborn condition in from the birth of the baby and during the embryogenesis it is called the innate immunity it means when a inborn immunity have in a baby that is called the innate immunity second types when when we acquire some immunity by the vaccination or the injection medicine by the different ways that is called the acquired immunity same the innate immunity next is the to have the two different types of barrier in our body when we when we get inborn immunity like in a mechanical barrier there is so many mechanical barrier in the host body like like the calcium potassium channel on the cell membrane it is also provide a innate immunity and the physiological barriers like the mucus and the slesmus and the excretion of the acids during digestion in alimentary canal also provide innate immunity but in the acquired immunity also have the two types the active and the passive active active acquired immunity as a production of antibody when a specific foreign and particles into enter in into the host body and release some toxin that time our immune system start to a production of antibody against specific antigen it is called the antibody formation that is it is the acquired active antibody active means that when it is depend on the conditional and the environmental when conditional will be hap happened with the host that the time be immune system will be active and control to the environmental change as our adaptation S second acquired acquired immunity that is the passive it means the vaccination when we in infected by the smallpox that time we that time that is a myth in our society we should not go to the doctor as in the smallpox that's that is a really wrong that is because with the 7 days or 15 days working as to production of antibody against the smallpox this time is required for the production of antibody not for the we should not go to the doctor so that is the immunity system which is develop in our our in our own body and to acquire immunity for the antigens or pathogens <coughs> for more detail please log on to www.gurukpo.com thank you thank you and thank you.